Okay, here is an experiment we put together to be able to show you how Marie Curie was measuring the radiation off of radioactive devices. The item on your right is a quadrant electrometer. She used one of these. It's a voltmeter that draws hardly any current at all, but measures voltage. We're going to show you in the center here there's a string hanging down. And this actually will act exactly like the volt the quadrant electrometer. On the extreme left, this is sort of a fancy thing that shows you sort of the pretty effects you can get. Now, what he's going to charge up the system to put electricity and you're going to be measuring the voltage. What's happening? This the electrons are going into the strings, etc., and they repel each other like a gold leaf electrometer. And now that shows that there's a voltage stored there. It's stored. Now there's some leakage, so it's gradually coming back together again. But she can hurry it up by bringing some radiation from a device that simulates the radiation from a radioactive material. She's got that, now she'll bring it over. Here she comes. This is ionizing the air. Look how fast that comes down. And then it's not all the way down, it takes a long time because, we, yeah, by comparison. Now she touches the ball and that takes the rest of it. So she's leaking off with her hand the electricity that was stored. So we could do it very fast one more time. She cranks it up, charges it up, puts voltage. There they go. And when she stops, it'll collapse very slowly, very, very slowly. Now if you bring radiation close to it, like here comes the radium, you look at what happened over there, and then she brings it over to the thing. See how it's coming down? Coming down. Now she can get rid of the rest of it by just touching it, showing that you can leak it off with your hand also. So this very expensive quadrant electrometer on the right can be replaced in principle with a string, a humble string that shows the whole effect with a string of measuring radiation and it's that simple. Ta-da!